Good morning. As you can see guys, I am back home. I am back in my Belfast room. She was so messy. I kind of just sorted everything out. Um, but I don't think I've said hi. So, hi. I got my vaccine yesterday, my very first one. So, my arm is still a little bit sore, but I didn't really get any side effects. I think I was just a little bit more tired than normal. Um, but that is super exciting, so if you can get your vaccine booked, go for it. They're doing over 18s in Northern Ireland, um, and I think my second dose will be in August at some point. I just have a bunch of work to do this morning, so I'm going to get started. I'm editing the final Dublin Diaries, which I have this like vision for, it, and I really hope I can do it justice. Um, yeah, a little bit emo. I was like importing all the footage yesterday, and I was like, oh my gosh just like an end of an era um but yeah so i'm gonna get started on that just made some coffee memory at the end of our college years i got two new tattoos one in abby's handwriting so i guess she's with me for life and another i have spent over two hours editing the first one minute these days feels like summer if I didn't have so much editing to do I'd spend all day outside reading being in the sun oh makes me feel so much better my hair is a stiff I've not gotten ready today no need no need just at my desk Okay, so I promise this is organized chaos, but the bag I'm using is this duffel kind of rucksack from Patagonia. I actually picked this out whenever I was working with Zalando because Patagonia is an amazing brand and I know this is the perfect size for traveling whenever I travel again. But I basically divided all my clothes up into, we've got like dresses, sweatpants, fun trousers, t-shirts, fun going out tops, a few pairs of jeans, I'm obviously going to wear these as well, that's skincare, this is jewellery. I used to have these like packing cubes that I got from Ikea a few years ago which would have been so useful um, but I only have like the really tiny ones which I guess you could use for like underwear and stuff. Um, so I don't know where I put those, but my main tactic, I guess, is just going to be like rolling things. I'll probably put jeans and stuff at the bottom because they're the heaviest. 
If I was super organized, I would plan out my few outfits that I'm going to be wearing in Dublin so I don't have to like go through all my nicely packed luggage. But I haven't thought that far, so I'll come to that hurdle whenever I get there. I made the most definitive packing list last night on my Notion. All of these are like little toggle lists. Um, so I can check them off to make sure I haven't forgotten anything, especially this kind of stuff. But I think I have all my clothes and I just need to sort out my shoes. Crocs hand down, best purchase. Um, I've got two like platform wedges these ones are from mista these ones are my mum's old ones from sketchers dog martin sandals i'm not going to bring my actual dogs because they're so bulky and then i've got my nike shoes and then also my converse need to find those um yeah i'll bring these we are ready to go back to dublin this is so heavy i feel like i might topple over um but yeah see you on the flip side Regular or large? Regular. Okay. We got vegan burger king. Oh, look at you. Mm -hmm. What did you get? The chicken one? The chicken. I got the plumpest whopper. Dun, 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 dun. Mm. Is that meat? Mm hmm. She really tastes like meat. Every time, but it 
made it um, to London, safe and sound. I thought I'd just pop in and give you guys a little update because that was kind of all just like montage -y. I'm actually editing the video as we speak. But I am in Abby's room. She's at the hairdressers at the moment, so I'm just getting some work done. But you guys have no idea how happy and excited I am to be here. It is beautiful, the weather stunning like 25 degrees abby's parents are so lovely to let me stay here for a bit i'll be here for i think like 10 days i also want to say thank you so much for all the lovely messages and comments i got in my last video um it truly truly means the world and i haven't been able to reply to all of them but like i don't know i think i just like make videos and put them up there and i never really think about like actual people watching them and i know like a bunch of you comment and stuff but it still doesn't really feel real um so yeah, I just want to say thank you and I really appreciate it and I hope you will join me for whatever journey I am on, I don't really know, but that is what this summer is here for. I am going to focus on my videos and just living life <laughs> this summer. I'll talk to you guys soon, London vlogs to come. Oh, I actually don't really know what I want to call my next upcoming videos. Like are we going to do London Diaries? Let me know if you like London Diaries. Or like, because I'll be in London for a bit, I'm still not sure come September if I'm going to get a lease or not here. So is it London Diaries or is it going to be like adulting? I know Leah has her adulting diaries so I'm not going to do adulting diaries or anything like that but adulting? I guess I am adulting now, I'm no longer a student. Postgrad diaries? No. I don't know. Let me know if you have any name suggestions down below. I'd really appreciate it. But for the time being, um, I love you so much. Love you lots. I hope you're all doing well. Kisses. Okay, bye.